Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon White Randomizer Unlog with me, your main man, Tommy Lou. I hope you're well, I hope you're happy, and of course, I hope you're loving life. Let's get you at the start of the video. Hit, go down, scroll down, hit that like button, and leave me a comment. Let me let me know how you are, and of course, ask me a question. What do you want to know about me? I'm recording this off the back of the last episode. My hair is still a mess. My feet are cold. We have some serious story to progress today, but one more thing if you are not subscribed or if you know people who aren't subscribed, make sure you get them to subscribe and subscribe yourself because at 500 subscribers, I will be doing my very first ever sleep block and you do not want to miss that, but without further ado, let's progress. Such good animation. <laughs> what do you think, Tommy? How do you like the beautiful form of the Pokemon who appears before and fights beside the hero that will lead the way to a new world? Now, Reshiram and I will head to the Pokemon League and defeat the champion. This will be the last of the Pokemon battles that hurt Pokemon. A world for Pokemon alone. It's finally going to be a reality. Reshiram, no! If you want to stop me, you must become a hero as well. <laughs> That's right. When Reshiram's counterpart Zekrom recognizes you, we can finally be even. And then you can try to stop us. Well, what will you do? My prediction. If the future that I see is true, you will meet Zekrom. The Pokemon with you believe in you so strongly. Will you be the one who interferes with my formula for changing the world? If you want to protect the bonds between Pokemon and people, you must search for Zekrom. I'm sure it is awaiting for you in the form of the Dark Stone. Anen is out of here. He's leaving with the utmost swag. Tommy, did you see what <laughs> just flew off now? How could this happen? Why? Why? That that was that guy N, right? Why was he with the legendary Pokemon? He couldn't really be the hero, could he? Also, did I hear him tell you to search for the other Pokemon? Calm down. First, we go back. It's more important to decide what to do the next app and then analyze what happened. Astounding! I never would have imagined the legendary Dark and Type Pokemon would return now. That guy called N, Team Plasma's boss apparently, reawakened the legendary Pokemon. He told Tommy to look for the other legendary Pokemon, then flew away. Huh? There are two legendary Dragon type Pokemon? Oh man. Yes, there are. <laughs> yes. Yes, there are. Oh, it's fucking Aldo. Sorry, that was a swear. <laughs> Why, if it isn't Alder, I thought it was Drayden. If it isn't Alder, it's been a while. Have you been well? Ain't no time for chit chat. That fearsome column of fire that shot from the tower. That Pokemon has the power to destroy the world, man! If it's on Team Plasma's side, the Team Plasma tells everyone to release their Pokemon. No matter whether it comes from fear or admiration, the world can't help but change. But it will become a world where we are separated from Pokemon. Right. Moreover, the boss of Team Plasma, N, who re reckoned Reshiram, apparently said to look for the other Pokemon, Zephrom. If I remit. <laughs> Come on, Tommy Voices. <clears throat> if I remember the myth, Reshiram's fiery breath, along with the other Pokemon, devastated ancient Unova in an instant. Even knowing that, N is still wanting to awake the other? Huh? Isn't it dangerous to bring back a Pokemon that powerful? Hey, laddie. Hey, lass, miss. You're a very kind person. Still, I don't know if other Pokemon will be able to stand up to it, because no matter what, it is a legendary being. I don't like the idea of taking orders from him, but searching for the dragon... 
the, the, the stone. It might not be a bad plan. We certainly can't let Team Plasma reawaken both of them. Since I've traveled all over Unova, I might have an idea of where it might be. What the hell just happened to the voice? Hey, let's hit to Relic Castle. Tommy, everyone, I'm going. I see. <clears throat> I see, we'll leave you to that. Uh, I'm hopefully going to investigate the tower. I might find something. Then I will go with you. I think I understand it better now. Being able to do something for Pokemon, for somebody at a time like this, is strength. I'm sure of it. And my strength is something that is given to Pokemon. Okay, champion, let's hurry. Tommy, this has turned into such a big deal. I just wanted to go shopping, get a couple Pokemon, and make. <clears throat> it's so confusing. I don't know what to do. Are you going to go to Reddit Castle, Tommy? Yes, and that is, of course, as a casual reminder. If if you if you're just skipping through text and you like, I don't know what the hell to do. Of course, she tells us to go. Do we still not have Fly though? Have we been given Fly yet? Am I literally insane? How long have we had this? <laughs> I'm an idiot. How long have we had this for? Okay. I actually think we get rid of Twisted. Twisted just kind of sucks. I know it's arguably better than Dragon Rage now, but eh, meh. Um, so let's fly. So we've got a few places we can go. The main place, let's let's first, just in case, let's go all the way back, no, to Nakarine City. Flying on our Dragonite. I mean, that was a glitch because we flew up in the air and our body was just left behind. Now, I believe in this game you don't, ha you, like, you don't have to have empty party slots. So we're just going to try and go in. And of course, we're going to get our fossils. We're going to get our fossil encounters, which is this lady right here, I believe. Uh, let's do the Helix Fossil. It is Lord Felix. Oh, yeah, and in this game, they literally just come... It's a gloom! Sorry, your party is full. Uh, okay, alright. So, we actually do. That's kind of annoying. Um, let's let's throw two people in the box real quick. Uh, let's dump... Uh, may let's dump Gaiman and uh, Leafy on. Just for now, just for now. Just for now, gang! Gaiman's definitely back on the team because we need we want that water type. I forgot we even had a Rebella. So we got a Gloom. Interesting. Another poison type. It's a it's a good poison type. And to be honest, I'm almost gl glad it's a Gloom because at this stage in the game, well, actually, we need to find the stones. But it, okay, maybe it's not that good. Well, we will nickname the Gloom. Uh, do I have a nickname for this? Honestly, no. I'm gonna call this uh, Zappy as the first subscriber I could think of. And I don't think we've named a Pokemon after him. Zappy! And then, uh, we do still have a Pokemon, so we're gonna give her the Plume Fossil. Go on, be like... Be an Aerodactyl. I love an Aerodactyl. Lapras! What level are these? Because... Oh, God. Because oh, I... Right, okay. In Cage Lock, we had Sally the Lapras. But I have a Lapras in our gold and silver as well. And what did I name it? And I can't... I, I, I can't remember. I'm, I'm going to name this Sally. I'm going to name this Sally. I can't remember the, the current Lapras I have in uh, the gold and silver verses. We're just going to go with Sally. Here's a female. It works. It's good. Good. Um, level 25. Alright, so let's check out Sally first. Hardy by nature. Inner focus prevents flinching. It actually has got a good moveset. It's got a very good moveset. Let's check out Gloom. Honey gather. Meh. Alright, so. Look, Lapras is a fantastic Pokemon. But right now, I honestly just think it's an option. I think we keep gaming, because obviously gaming is like 14 levels higher. Um, 
It's 14 levels higher, but the thing is, like, having the ice type uh, coverage as well is fantastic. But we're gonna be getting a revive soon, and there is no reason why we can't revive Mari. And I'm honestly thinking that's what we do, because we've, we've lost, a f we, what, we've lost eight, I think. Let's just have a look. Uh, two, four, six, seven. We've got to... Oh, yeah, there's eight on the layout, because obviously we had to restart. Uh, we lost our starter in the original game. Um, I don't, I, I'm not seeing anyone here that I'm like, oh, yeah, revive you. I mean, Empoleon is a shout, but of course we've got loads of water types. And Tynamo is also a shout, but Dark, it's like Dark Ice. It's pretty good, man. It is pretty good. Having an electric type would be dope. Um, but the thing that makes um, Electros so good, honestly, like is, is its ability. It has levitate, so it so its weakness is it's immune to its weakness. Um, without that, it's kind of just another Pokemon. So. Uh, we're not going to go to Drift Surveil City. Yeah, actually we are. Actually we are. We're going to go buy some Mimimilks. We, we never fought you, actually, did we? Let's fight Heartbreaker Charles. Let's get Kai out from. Let's do this. Let's go. Because I didn't do this at the time because I was because I knew he had high levels. But, um, like, now we are more than capable of doing some serious damage. So we are going to Leaf Blade the Solasis. We are going to Thunder Wave. Uh, no, we're not. No, that's really silly, Thomas. We are going to Dragon Tail the Amoga. And we are going to Wake Up Slap the Flygon. That's a kill. That's pretty nice. The XP is actually so low. I, I, I thought that would be happening. No, no, no. Oh! Oh. That was terrifying, man. That was terrifying. Oh my good god. Okay, well, thankfully, Kai didn't... Kai didn't go down there. Um, so, we want to go... That was so close. That was horrifically close. I, I hate Amolgas, man. I swear to god. They just, like... They're so annoying. Let's just ride the bike there. Alright, let's let let's immediately get off the bike. Let's get back on the bike. And let's immediately get back off. <laughs> I kind of forgot that the bike was really bad on sand. Okay, so Kai is still out front, which potentially an issue. I think we're gonna be fine though. Did we battle all the trainers in here? I can't remember. Or did we say we'd come back and do that? Oh, we, we, if, we need to get lucky and get a Rage Candy Bar. Because Rage Candy Bars, if you use a Rage Candy Bar on one of those, it, you get an encounter. That is how... I, I don't know if you know this, but that is how you get Zen Mode Darmanitan. Which turns it from a fire type to psychic fighting, I believe. Or if it's not psychic fighting, it's just plain psychic. Oh, 
Dusty. Thirsty work be this recording. Fist plate! Yo, imagine if that had been like a master ball or something. That would have been such a misplay. Uh, that's the exits. You, I'm guessing we didn't fight you. We did not. Just some bonus experience. Just some bonus experience. Uh, we probably still don't want to fight this Braviary. Like, Braviary is a bit of a monster. Like, no lie. Actually, our defense is really good. Let's be bold. Let's stay in. Let's just quick attack you. We are huge power. Brilliant. Gotta love Kai. You gotta love Kai. Sacking. Let's do it. Come on, Kai. Show your true power. Boom! Oko in slackings. Let's go. Uh, absolutely not. Magical Leaf is special. I mean, no. <laughs> Just no. No. Uh, no, I said I don't want to forget that. Keep on moves. Thank you. We've got our special hitter in, uh... Baker! Oh, stop, Tommy. That's the entrance to Relic Castle. You're impressive, Tommy, making it here before I did. Dealing with the Desert Resort's Pokemon took longer than I would have thought. I only made it all the way out here thanks to my Pokemon. Really, bro? Because they're, like, level 16 to 20. I mean, kind of embarrassing. Alder went on ahead, let's hurry. As he stays outside. Did I get an encounter in Relic Castle? I must have done. Oh yeah, he's just there to tell you the mechanics of the sand pits. Josie, Josie! Again, I'm... Like, this is just good experience for Kai. Because these guys are low level... Because to be honest, like, I think, you know, the idea is when you're exploring the early game, you come into the desert for the first time, you come down here and you're like, oh, people, but then you can't progress uh, past the point that we're about to. Far-fetched. We'll keep at it. It's a far-fetched. Like, if we took down a Braviary, we can definitely take down a far-fetched. That's... Yep, we okoed it with Quick Attack. Fantastic. I'm so... Oh, no! Nab nab berry. For alligator. Oh, do you? I'm gonna quick attack. This might kill you anyway. Didn't. Oh, I actually don't know if we got an encounter here or not. And this is a for alligator, so I kind of want to. You know what? I'm almost certain we did. If I didn't, then I've just passed up an amazing encounter, but. It is what it is. Why not, baby? Why not? At the end of the day, we've got a good team. We've got a couple good options in the box. It would be a shame if we missed a potential thing, but I really don't think we have. Let's pop another Super Repel, because at this point, these mons are just very low level. Um, and we should... I want to throw Game In out front, honestly. That is what I want to do right now. Gaiman has the wise glasses. I think what we do is we take the lucky egg and we give Gaiman the lucky egg. Because we need Gaiman to get some lo levels for sure. And uh, I don't... Th oh, God, the dark darn it. I don't think uh, Extra Jill is one of these Pokemon that needs an item. We probably should give him one, actually. Now I'm saying that. You know what? Let's do it. There's literally no reason not to. Wait, we have the Rocky Helmet, don't we? Let's give him the Rocky Helmet. I search and search for the Rocky Helmet. I might never find one. Um, there we go. I knew we had it because I know, like you, we have. I, I knew it. We have two of them. Rocky Helmet, fantastic. Anyone hits him is gonna get a little bit of damage. Wait, do you not want to battle? Oh, she just gives us a fossil. I did not remember that. I mean, all right, <laughs> that's another encounter. 
Gets has told us that once again we should have test the power you have. We will see if you can defeat Team Plasma. I've heard about you. I heard that you work your Pokemon hard. <laughs> maybe I do, maybe I don't. What's it to you, Buster? Diamond is here to ruin your life. That's super effective, but we eat it. And this is a water pose. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Diamond. Oh, it's a kill. Pikachu. Well, that's a that's a. Actually, we probably should have let Kai take down Pikachu. Either way, Nathan Nathan just opens up the ground and just allows <laughs> destroys that Pikachu. Drillbur! 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 Kai! I don't even know if he's... Didn't mean to do that. Not gonna lie to you. I don't actually know if he's Steel-type yet. It shouldn't matter, though. <laughs> Kate the Poet was defeated. Let's go! Into the hole. Come on, suck me down. Well, now, that's... Alright. Let's not use that out of context. Balm Mushroom. Now, we can sell that for a high price. I'll buy it for a high price. Mighty Yena. We probably could have let, um... I, again, we can't really stay in. It's stab dark. Um, we probably could have let Kai handle these people. The fact that Kai is huge power and has very good defense is actually a, uh, like a good, very good thing. Ooh, dearie me, that was a lot of damage. But good job we stocked up on Moo Moo Milks. You can, you can make, you can slow us down all you like, Mike Yenna. As soon as Jeffrey slaps you, you are gonna... Alright, well... Baker, do your thing. Yo, why is everyone so confused? It ain't that confusing. Just hit the mighty Yena. Thank you. Blissy. Blissy, blissy. Yo, we need Drain Punch. That would be amazing. Amazing. Wake Up Slap's such a good move, and like the Conkelda line gets it so early on. Oh, why am I so thirsty? That was so much experience. What? That's insane. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're gonna we, we're gonna keep gaming out front because I mean it's almost the same level as uh, Kai now. Um, but we're just gonna we're just gonna level up the guys. Boom. Oh yeah, I, I always forget in this game. I think this is the yeah, so they don't do the super rough bell thing, but they do do the iteration where they're like. Yeah, you don't have to go back out into the menu each time you want to heal someone. You can just be here. You don't want to get sucked down that hole. You want to run around here, I do believe. Oh, hello, Zap. Oh, for every time we leave a game in, we get hit with something that he can't take down. It's ever so frustrating. Um, we are going to go in the Nathan. Yo, you're charging on me, bruh. You charging on me, bro? We're gonna rock slide you. That should okay. <gasps> now pluck me, pluck you. <laughs> Did him dum ch. Beautiful. Handled like a pro. Bug buzz. Anyone learn that? That's a really good move. Um, we don't have any bug type moves. Bug type. Uh, this is the generation where bug type really started to become like a thing that wasn't trash. <laughs> the only one is Nathan. That's so unnecessary. If it was Mega Horn, that'd be different, but it's not. Yo, straight down the hole. None of this suction business. I might do a save state here because I always remember which hole you're supposed to fall down. 
look at Sizzle, just like, he's like, he's sparring, he's just vibing, he's like, yeah, which way am I gonna go? Which way am I gonna go? <laughs> is it steel that resists water or water that resists steel? Let's find out! That actually did more than I thought it would. I can't lie to you. Get the confusion. B E A U. Hit yourself. That's going to do more damage. Yikes. We actually can't stay in because if he connects, that's actually going to do a lot of damage. Uh, bug, 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 bug. Uh, we resist, I believe. Okay, so this is a bit worrying. Um, I want to say we outspeed, because we should, right? Um, thing is, no one is living another Fury. I can't believe he hasn't hit himself. This is some straight BS. We have to stay in. It's right, so Fury Cutter gets does more damage each like the more you use it consecutively. We've got a Dragon Rage here and hope it kills. I thought we would outspeed. Let's hope you don't have 40 HP left. You didn't. Oh my good god, that was terrifying. We haven't lost a Pokemon in a little while. That I didn't think we would lose one to a Sizzle using Fury Cutter, but that got, that like went from 0 to 100 real quick. Hot diggity damn, okay. So, uh, cause that's the thing, I think it wants you to like, get tripped up and go in this hole, or is it the fact that it's like, no, it, it's always the one where the trainer is, right? Because that's, that's story. I think there might be an item down the other route, but we're going to go for story. We're actually coming up to the 30 minute mark. I don't know how, because we're not, we haven't done anything. <laughs> We've done literally nothing. Uh, we're going to go for some nightshades here. Do we have speed? We actually do. This is super effective. This should kill. Chandelure, one of my favorite Pokemon of Gen 5. We are 100% uh, uh, putting one on the team if we can catch it. Uh, Ledian, I think we stay in, to be honest with you. I think we just stay in, and we're going to go for a Water Pulse. Because we, we we got the boosts from Ominous Wind. And this is a Brian moment. Guaranteed kill. No matter how fast you are, Ledian, you're, you're guaranteed to die. So, joke's on you, really. Ominous Wind. That's an okay. Boom. Silk Scarf! Straight down the hole. Now, I do want to try and keep these episodes under 30 minutes. So, I am going to end the episode here. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like the video if you haven't already. And subscribe if you're not. Because we are going to do our very first sleep block at 500 subscribers. I have been your main man, Tommy Lou. I hope you enjoyed. And I will see you in the next episode. Yeah! Tommy, Tommy Lou, Tommy Lou. Tommy, Tommy Lou, na 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 na. Tommy, Tommy Lou.